Hello, people of the internet. My name is Combat Wombat. Welcome to another episode of the series where I take a look at angry comments. A lot of the time I'll pick comments from a specific video, but this time I'm feeling fruity. So I've got some from two of my videos. If you haven't seen either of these videos, these comments may make less sense. So watch them. I need the watch time. Speaking of watch time, hear me out. A lot of you are subscribed, but you don't have on bell notifications. Like, only around 10,000 of you do. So the rest of you, do me a solid and turn on notifications so you'll know when I upload. Please! I need the attention! Alright, I'm done begging. On to the comments. First, we'll take a look at the comments on my video calling out Cody ITC for his fake spirit contacting videos. Disliked. Oh man, someone disliked my video? Time to get the old weeping pillow. <laughs> no, but I get it. YouTube did remove dislikes, so you gotta just comment disliked now. But ol' Rayman here didn't stop there. Reported. Oh, come on, man. You're gonna report my video for calling out some douche canoe using a tragedy for views? SMH my head. Yeah, this guy just didn't stop. He was ruthless and out for blood. Just because you're worthless in life and not good at anything but making garbage videos doesn't mean you have to hate on someone. <laughs> Stop hating. Clout chaser never stop. Yeah, I wasn't just hating, my guy. Or clout chasing, for that matter. What clout is there to gain off of his name? Who the fuck even knows who Cody ITC is? Any of you? Probably not. Unless you're really into the paranormal. Or shit. Maybe if you're a shit connoisseur, you might know who Cody ITC is. Nah, I think the videos are real. There's no real evidence that they aren't, other than people just being skeptical. We will never know how ghosts or the afterlife actually works completely until we're there. Honestly, I think humans, especially Americans, are just so close-minded. Sure, maybe it's fake but it's still illogical to assume you know every single thing in the universe that's possible. Yeah man, I, I don't think that it's the fact that I'm an American that makes me not believe in ghosts. It's because they're not fucking real. There's no proof they are. And in a world where science is trying to figure out how things work, you would think they would have gotten to the whole spirits thing. Most proof for ghosts is just people's personal stories of seeing one, and shitty videos on YouTube that, despite it being 2021, are recorded with a Sony Walkman slathered with peanut butter, farted on, then thrown into a river before being used to record a ghost encounter. Did you see it? No! I can't see shit! I just got a job as security in a hospital. There's lots of spooky areas there and people have obviously passed. There's an old morgue. Housekeeping told me it's haunted. I haven't seen shit. But who knows? If I see a ghost, I'll let you know. Someone replied to this individual. Imagine saying this is real, lol. This kinda just proves my point about how close-minded people can be. You don't know everything. You know what? You're right. I shouldn't call out Cody ITC for using Gabby Petito's name after her passing, knowing her story was all over the news and he would get a ton of views. I'm just close-minded and I don't know everything, so maybe he really did contact her ghost. Totally not a voice actress. Thank you, girl from Fiverr.com. Here's your five dolens for your time. All you do is try to debunk videos. You got that right, and I'm damn good at it. Bitch. You haven't uploaded a video in two months, and your return to YouTube is this gringe? Good thing you have a fan base of loyal lapdogs to watch this gringe. God damn it. I hate when people say my videos are gringe. May as well just punch me straight in the cack at that point. Shit hurts. I swear, people these days find a way to hate on everything. People should be fucking grateful for what Cody and other spirit box slash paranormal researchers are doing. This is YouTube. 90% of the people who upload on YouTube got some kind of goal. Money, subscribers, fame, etc. I see nothing wrong with this at all. Give the spirits a voice. Let them tell their story. It's beautiful. Yeah, no, eat my ass. I'm not gonna be grateful for what Cody ITC does. He doesn't give spirits a voice. 
the fucker claims to have talked to Michael Jackson's ghost. Are you shitting me? You would have to be a certified freak seven days a week to believe this bullshit. Do you believe he's talked to the devil too? Because he claims that he has. You think that Gabby Petito's ghost really came back to talk to some random wiener on YouTube for his video? Right, whatever you say. This hod guy here started talking to himself and pretending to at someone named Jay Harv. But Jay only exists in this guy's mind. He was talking to himself. Poor ass clown lost his mind. This last comment, someone made a pretty good point. So, they have to contact spirits only a few days after death so they're not too far gone or something, but can contact spirits of people who died decades ago. Yeah, makes sense. Good point. There seems to be inconsistent rules with Cody's bullshit videos. He claimed he made a video so soon after a musician's passing because you don't want their spirit to move on before you can talk to them. In reality, the sooner he makes a video, the more views he can get because it's a fresh story. They had just passed. But he can somehow contact Michael Jackson and Martin Luther King, who died decades ago. Where is the consistency in this bullshit? Then some wiener replied, Lamau, you don't understand energy. The more people think of you, the more energy your spirit has. It's a few days for the people who aren't world famous, like Dolph. But XXX has been with several of the other rappers he's contacted in multiple sessions, and MLK and JFK are famous across multiple generations, so it's easier for them to communicate with this realm. Okay, so now, suddenly, the rules are, the more people think about you, the more energy your spirit has. What kind of anime plot device bullshit is this? So because JFK, yeah, apparently he talked to JFK, guys, and Michael Jackson are famous, that is why he can still talk to their ghosts years later? So the spirit realm cares about clout. Got it. Suck me. All right, that's enough dumb comments from the Cody ITC video. In closing, his videos are doo-doo, he's a douchebag, and even other paranormal channels call him out for his bullshit. Okay, so I got less angry comments on my GTA Definitive Edition video. People seem to agree that it was a disaster, but let's take a look at the people who didn't like what I had to say. Damn, people complain too much. You know how grateful we were when these games came out? People want too much nowadays. That's why video games suck. They try and make them too realistic. I'm so glad I grew up when I did Jesus. People were grateful when the original games came out because they were groundbreaking and well-made. These remasters are neither. They're liquid poopy juice. And they're worse than the originals. That's why people are angry about them. Your thumbnail is bullshit, though. Is it, though? I don't think it is. I assume he's talking about the image I used. That's an actual glitch someone encountered while playing the game. So, no, it's not bullshit. Just fucking babies crying because all they know is GTA 5. I grew up on this, and I personally love the remaster. It's not over the top enough to take away from the old school experience, and the bugs are funny, and what made the game back in the day. My guy, I was shitting in my diapies when Vice City came out, and I was playing it in my diapies. It's one of the first games I ever played. So, no, GTA 5 is not all I've played in the series. In fact, it's my least favorite. Vice City is my favorite, and they shat all over it with the remaster. And the bugs are funny, even the game-breaking ones? Sure, Chief. Stop trying to compare them to next-generation games we are currently getting today. I don't think I did. A single time. Enjoy the nostalgia and stop the fucking complaining. Deep throat that rockstar cock and give them your money with no expectations of quality. No thanks. You can suck me. All I have seen is people bitch about how bad these games are. They are remasters, not remakes. Yeah, remasters being worse than the originals is quite a fuck up, my guy. To be fair, I quite prefer everything that is making this game pathetic to you. Because this is how it ran for me 17 years ago, so shut the fuck up. No, you! I played the originals when I was a zygote. I don't remember the character models looking like refried sims who ate a little too much Taco Bell. I don't remember these insane glitches. I don't remember Tommy being thick. I wish he was, though. That was an improvement. <clears throat> God, I would squeeze that man's cheeks. Hey, if you prefer this shit, 
good for you. Most of us don't. They're worse than the originals in almost every way. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed these angry comments. I know I did. Thanks for watching and have a good one.